assalamu alaikum all right guys so in today lecture uh, we will be discussing about some units related to shipping and logistics uh, guys if you will uh, ever ask any freight forwarder like ff uh, to take your goods from china to uk usa or from your own country to any other country and you will tell them that give me um, rate of 1 kg uh, that how much you charge for 1 kg or what will be the rate or charges for this much dimension so they will directly uh, know that you are someone new b to sourcing and logistics and you don't know that how to do deal uh, in this case so guys let me tell you and give you a short overview of cbm uh, it's not a short overview it's a lengthy video guys in sourcing in containers uh, the the unit used is basically cbm cubic meter right so everything that you ship from one country to another country will be shipped uh, in a unit in a measurement of cbm cubic meter so how will you calculate the cbm of your cartons and your products suppose you are having uh, 16 units what right guys 16 units in one carton okay and the length width height in inches for that specific carton in which those 16 units you are going to place are 25 25 25 inches and the weight is uh, suppose 50 pounds so now what is going to be the cubic meter uh, for our one carton right so this calculator will calculate for you those uh, the cubic meter uh, so that you can ask from the supplier uh, sorry from the freight forwarder that uh, what what are the charges for one cbm right and they will have to give you uh, two rates okay one rate for cbm volume based as you can see here and cbm weight based uh, they will ask you information like uh, what is the product dimension and what are, what are, what is the weight of that product so before telling them anything you will tell them that please give me the rate of cbm volume based and cbm weight based so they might tell you that uh, cbm volume based is like uh, 40 and as well for Uh, weight based it's also 40 the same rates are for both 40 dollars 40 dollars i'm just supposing giving you example then you will determine that which rate is more better for you okay at which rate is more better for you cuz now you can see here that weight based your cbm is becoming 0.02 air and volume based it's becoming 0.26 so you will be in benefit if you will opt for volume based cbm so you 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 will have taken the rates of cbm volume based and weight based initially so you can now uh, determine that which aspect is more beneficial for you so in your case now you will uh, opt for the volume weight based they might force you uh, in some cases like if you are having very low uh, weight product so you will have to accept uh, them because they will treat you with volume based cbm instead of weight based but you can just negotiate with them as well uh, depending upon uh, these terms so here you can see that uh, 25 25 25 inches so this calculator has calculated for me volume based cbm that is becoming 0.26 so what is basically the formula here uh, we are dividing this volume by c17 which is 61024 okay so whatever volume you get uh, in inches you will divide that in uh, divide that by 61000 and 024 okay so you will get the cbm volume based and if you want to know the cbm weight based so what is going to be the formula uh, you will divide 50 by 2.205 and divide by 1000 so you will get volume weight based calculation for yourself and then you can negotiate with your freight forwarder at uh, so that he can like uh, give you some discount if uh, you are getting good amount in uh, like saving good amount in a weight based uh, cbm and they might force you to opt for volume based because uh, your volume for products is really high so they will not be uh, dealing with you in cbm weight based but still you can just tell them that hey guys my cbm for weight is so much low so instead of charging me uh, for one cbm in volume 40 pounds or 40 dollars you should charge me like uh, 30 dollars instead of that because i am not i am dealing with you in volume based so uh, you should give me little bit discount because if if i uh, force to give me the volume uh, weight based cbm so i was getting like this much charges and they were so low 
but you all are forcing me for your volume base so you should also give me a little bit discount in this case so guys this is cbm and this is the unit used for uh, sourcing and logistics uh, in containers in sea freights and you will have to use and understand this specially because uh, of getting not getting scammed um, by the freight forwarders and that you should deal and negotiate with them in a proper way and professional way. Thank you.